Hey, everybody! Welcome to Rachel's Room every Thursday I answer your questions. That's all. Let's begin! Let's begin! Do you have a thigh gap? Girl! You think I have time for a thigh gap? Please. Also, I've never noticed a thigh gap on someone. I've never in my entire life been like, oh, that person has a thigh gap, yes! I'm like, human. Literally have never noticed a thigh gap on someone. If you were to switch bodies with Colleen, like on Freaky Friday, what is the first thing that you would do? Uh, I would probably touch my boobs, meaning touch Colleen's boobs. That girl has some massive boobs on her, so I would definitely touch them to see what they were like. Probably bounce around a little. Is it really terrible that the first thing I would do is touch my sister's boobs? I'm just being honest. Or I'd scream a lot. I'd look in the mirror and scream and then maybe touch my boobs. So it's one of like the first five things I would do is touch her boobs. When was the last time you kissed someone? This morning, I kissed Matt on the cheek to get him out of the bed because I needed to film this video. I couldn't watch your vlog on sex museum because it's age restricted! Okay, so on my vlog channel, I filmed myself going to a sex museum in Amsterdam, but because I labeled it sex museum, freaking YouTube slash Google was like, what is this? No! And put an 18 year old or age restriction on it. It's actually not that ridiculous. It's definitely like PG-13, but not R. It's basically just a bunch of videos of statues doing it and some mannequins. But there's no like actual porn involved. So what I'm gonna do, I feel really bad because I didn't want to take down the vlog or change the title because that looks weird when people do that on your channel. Everyone goes, what did you do? Why did you take it down? Blah, 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 blah. So what I'm gonna do for all of those who wanted to watch it but couldn't, I'm going to re-upload it, put it on unlisted and name it just unlisted video so that Google won't catch on that it's, you know, Bad. So I'm gonna put the link here and also below so you guys can click that you can only watch it if you have the link That way it doesn't look like I'm double uploading or anything. It's not gonna look weird You guys can just go and watch it if you were underage and couldn't watch it That's the vlog so for all of those of you who are feeling very left out. That's for you guys. You're welcome I'm just a really really good person. I'm just doing this out of the kindness of my heart What percentage of subs are guys? I don't know let me find out. All right, so I've looked it up and only 18% of my viewers slash subscribers are male. That actually makes me sad. Whatever. Woman power! But for all those guys who are watching, thanks. You are a minority. How's it feel? We should get more guys on here. How do I do that? How do I get more guy subscribers? Should I take off my clothes? That always works. No, I have self-respect, sort of. Does it bother you that your famous birthday picture is this? Here's the picture, close up. This is the worst picture ever taken. My eyes are closed. It's from a down angle. I basically look like I'm sleeping standing up. And you wanna know why this is this? I'm pretty darn sure it's because for months I was getting emails being like, hey Rachel, do you want your birthday on famous birthdays? And I I was like, this is just seems weird. And I just didn't respond because I was like, how did they get my email? What is happening? I don't know what's going on. So I just like didn't respond for months. And then all of a sudden people started tweeting me this picture being like, you're on famous birthday stars. Look at your picture. And I'm like, that was so mean of them because everyone else's pictures are like, mm, oh, I'm so gorgeous. Oh, uh, what? But mine, I'm like, they did this on freaking purpose because I didn't respond to them. Why did they need me to respond in order to put the date of my birth on their website? That's why I was like, they don't need my permission to put the day I was born on something. Like, that's ridiculous. They do not need that. I am actually very angry about it because that is just a hideous picture of me. Can you put your foot behind your head? Yes, everybody can. See, they're behind my head. They're there. Oh, I've got some trash on my foot. Good. All right, last question. Thoughts on Ingrid coming out as gay? Who in the world is Ingrid? I have to look up who Ingrid is. I spelled Ingrid wrong. Ingrid Nelson? Oh, beauty guru. Oh, that's why I don't know that person because I don't watch beauty channels, clearly. The only thing I get from this is that she is gay and cute, so good for her. I hope that she got a positive response and not a negative response coming out. If you guys are her fans, I'm sure that she got a very positive response because you guys are awesome. Maybe I should watch her channel. Maybe I should start watching beauty guru channels. Maybe I would get some tips and tricks on how to do things because I just do the same thing every day. Except today I put on a little lipstick. Did you notice? Did you notice? Did you notice? Nope, because who cares? All right, that's it for the day. Please comment below and leave your questions so I may answer them on next week's Rachel's Room. Also, you can tweet me your questions using the hashtag Rachel's Room. Subscribe to, see, to this channel. Things have Tuesday, Thursday videos come here. Remember, if you want to watch the age-restricted vlog that you weren't allowed to watch, link below. That's it. I love you guys. And remember, stay awesome, possums.